Hi, I had a viewer question about how to make clean transitions on Erkenegg during the triple stop section. Okay, I believe it is Andy Chua. Uh, sorry if I pronounced your name incorrectly, but okay, here's my answer to you. It's all about releasing the bow, okay? One good place to start, my late professor Vartan Manugian, he had these foundations of shifting, foundations of thirds, foundations of six books, foundations of modal scales too, I believe, and just gold, just gold. Um, definitely worth checking out. I do not know if they're still commercially available, but they're awesome, okay? And the foundations of shifting books, especially the beginning, the way it teaches the release and all that in both the left and the right hands, that really helps with coordination for getting a clean sound on pieces like Erkenig. Okay, so wh what do I mean by releasing? So you have this triple stop section because you have the beginning, which is and then that famous part. And then later on, uh, it turns into a triple stop where you have a fingered octave. Okay, and then you start a, a third, the voice on the bottom. Okay, and I believe this is where Andy's question was, how do we make that clean? Well, here's the thing. When you're going really fast and the bow is in spiccato, okay, then there's a natural release of the bow because the bow is off the string. But when you're practicing slowly, which when you practice this piece, you should do it slowly, the bow should be on the string so you can coordinate the release. So how I would do that is... Find the note. Make sure I settle all the hand, the left hand, the left wrist, the right hand, and relax. Now, I will purposely make sure I release at the midpoint of the bow. Okay? I don't want to release too near the tip because then I don't have time to coordinate. And especially since I'm going to be jumping the bow, okay? Uh, that's not going to be happening at the tip. I want to make this as natural to my actual finished product as possible. So I'm going to keep the, all my releases around the middle. Okay. There it is. Release, relax. Release. And as I release, I'm moving both elbows. Okay. To prepare the left hand for the next note. Remember, the finger shouldn't move by itself. It should always be supported by the elbow. It shouldn't go independently and try to hurt itself. Okay? Always supported by the elbow. Release. Feel it. Release. Feel it. Play. Release. And always feel the note in the hands before you play it. Okay? So you release to help you you release and act in the middle of the bow and after the release you let the hand settle into the new note then you play it that will really help the cleanliness hope this helps cheers